Hello everyone, it's me, Gilgarach, and welcome back to Mega Walls. Today we're playing with the Enderman kit, as well as not as not starting re the recording as when the gates fall, we're starting when the walls fall, because I want my videos to be more action-packed, unlike they were, like, last month. And yeah, I think that would help my channel a lot, other than j to just have, like, ten minutes of just crappy commentary, and <laughs> a whole video with, um... FPS freezes, but yeah, we're about to reach the wither. He's right here, and boom, we're gonna do some damage real quickly. So, this Enderman is a really good rushing class. So this is why I'm using it. And, and I've actually been using Enderman quite a lot ever since the last video. Um, I have nine eight nine nine eight Enderman, which is very high level. I'm um. I'm two upgrades away from fully max Enderman, and then after that, if I get 250 more, well, 250,000 more coins, I can get Prestige for this class, and the Prestige level one allows me to get um, uh, two extra hearts when I um, play a game. So yeah, that's pretty neat, and then I can actually play normal without losing automatically, like I usually do, even though I have almost FM Enderman. FM means fully max if you don't already know. And you might also notice that there's new keyboard sounds in the background. You can hear my new keyboard. I got the Steel Series Apex 100 yesterday. It's actually pretty nice. It's not like, like my old keyboard. I, I like moving my keyboard around and like readjusting it like every few minutes to, you know, be better at PvP. But this keyboard like sticks to my desk so I can't actually move it around. So that kind of sucks, but... Soon I'll get used to it, and everything will be okay, and I'll still be a PvP god, as you can see. I'm really bad. But yeah, we're just gonna try our best to get through all this cobblestone. Hopefully they didn't block it all up. Yep. Alright. Watch this kid come for us. Boom! And we're up. Also, a tip for Enderman, if you're rushing, if there's defenders, you always want to hit the defenders while you're also attacking the wither. Because if you have, well, with soul charge, depending on how high, on how high your um, level is with um, soul charge, you get regeneration based on well, you get regeneration when you have full charge, like your EXP bar, you can see, like, like it's level 100. That means I'm ready to use my ability, like teleport, and teleport, basically. If you aim at a certain, if you aim at someone in a certain range, you can teleport to him, and you also get speed 3, so you can catch up to him while he's running. So yeah, Enderman's a very good um, mobility class, and it also has Feather Falling 4 on its boost, so it's really good for final kills when there's, like, people up there. And then there's one person down there trying to run away, so you can just jump down very easily. So yeah, Enderman's my favorite class now. I, I hardly use Zombie anymore. The only class is, well, the only class I use now is Enderman. I'm trying to level up Hero Brian for fun, as well as Dreadlord, because Dreadlord is the best rushing class, and I really enjoy rushing. And yeah, it's, Mega Walls has been pretty fun, but the only thing bad about well, there's nothing really bad about Mega Walls. It's just that high, all of High Pixel has a problem. There's, there's no more. Well, there's not much of a challenge anymore because I've actually played the game for almost a year now. So there's not much of a challenge, other than like my only challenge left now is to like get level 100, which I'll probably get that at, like the end of summer vacation or sooner. But I just want to find more challenges in all of High Pixel. But I can't also find a good game mode that has like plenty of players to where you can get into a game immediately and start it. Just not much of a challenge. You know? Oh! <laughs> Stupid me. I'm gonna teleport to these duders. And then I could just circle strafe the heck out of this wither. As you can see, I love rushing! Ah! Let's quickly get this wither down to possibly 400 health before we die. Let's pop. And it is some health. 
Let's pop another one. We okay, let's pop one now because Earthquake does a lot of dam damage. So, yeah. Alright. Oh, damn. We got them to 372 health. That is wonderful. And my Ender Chest perk worked. And, um, what, and speaking of that, Ender Chest, basically, um, if you die as Enderman, you have a chance to keep your inventory. And I have level 8 for that, which means I get around, like, 30, I get a 35% chance of keeping my inventory when I die. So that's pretty handy for when you're rushing. And I just make three more sets just in case, because usually it doesn't work, because it's lower than 50%. But at least it's higher than 25%, so, yeah, it's pretty nice. I feel like I'm getting better at commentary just by making this video, because I'm just talking about Mega Walls, and it's actually working maybe a whole 10 minutes this video has actually been going on for at least five minutes i think at least for what i think because um you know mega walls well mega walls games go on for one hour and i started when um i started recording when the walls fell so that's another 10 minutes gone so mega walls games during pvp usually last about 50 minutes so and whether it's no longer in rage at I think the 40 minute marker so yeah and basically what when a, when the wither is enraged that means um they won't use like their special abilities like lightning or earthquake or inferno so that comes in handy when you know uh, I don't know when it comes in handy but I just know it comes in handy and I just got killed by an ability spammer an arcanist and every arcanist is an ability spammer for sure because an Arcanist's ability takes three hits to actually charge, so it's, its Arcane Beam is also a bit too strong for my liking. But, yeah, stuff's been going pretty well for me in Mega Walls. Let's quickly kill this zombie right here. Ta-da! There's me a free assist. That's, the first, that's like the first kill slash assist of the game. Oh god, this guy is getting wrecked already because of lightning. And yeah, lightning and earthquake packs a lot of damage. All of um, the wither's abilities besides Inferno packs a lot of damage. Um, I think lightning does the most damage. It does 10 hearts, no matter how much armor you have. Because I almost got like one shot when I got at the wither. I didn't even hit it like once, and I was on another map, like off recording. Damn, look, look at their wither health already. They're at 77, and we're not so far behind. So... We need to hurry up and kill them before they kill us. I'm gonna quickly drop all this stuff right in front of me and then walk straight into it. And what you just saw there was my gathering skill. I'm not gonna talk about that. Because it's annoying for me to talk about stuff you you guys probably already know. So, yeah. We're just gonna quickly kill this wither and then we're gonna get on to final kills. I hopefully can... Like, well, I can hopefully get around maybe... Two final kills this game. Oh god. Yes! I killed a wither in a hole. Well, a creeper in a hole. And creepers are really hard if you're fighting them in a hole. And here we go. Final kills time. Here we go. So we're gonna whip our compass. And then just look for people to kill. Let's go down here. Let's take a detour. Maybe look for some nerds. Oh, shit. Sorry. <laughs> I feel so bad for that guy after I just stole his kill. That, that is so mean. So cruel. But I hope he's fine with it. I mean, it's only it's only Mega Walls. How serious can it be? And before I lose this game and <laughs> my keyboard's on the other side of the room. <laughs> I don't actually rage that much. Not <laughs> Mega Walls isn't that big of a deal to me. I don't take it that seriously. So let's. Oh, someone's close. Hello. Uh. Oh, they're down there. And he's already dead. They must be. Up. Yep, they're up here. So um, I have my full. My um, I have a full charge, so I can just hop up here with my teleport skill. And boom. Easy kills. Come on, come on.
We're dealing hella damage to this shaman. And the shamans are actually pretty hard to kill. Bye. <laughs> that was awkward. I I killed a shaman with fall damage. It's actually kind of hard to kill some shamans because most hero they're mostly well they're usually like max class because hero, hero classes are meant to be playing as fully max classes because they're really OP. And also max classes are pretty fun to actually play. Coming from some people actually who actually play the classes. They should be in here, I think. No? Hello? Oh, never mind. Oh, shit. Damn. Oh, <laughs> Q. GG. Well, there's three and two, so that's pretty good. Hey, I'm on the leaderboard. I got third place. So, yeah, that was a pretty fun game for me. That was really nice of me. You also see that I got level 77 in the bottom of my screen, which is pretty nice. I'm leveling up really fast because of auto tip. I'm sorry. I'm an auto I'm an auto tip try harder. Don't please don't hurt me. But yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and I'll see the rest of you in the next video. Peace.